Hey everyone, Zerjita here with the XBLA Fans channel. I'm here to give you a quick taste of Maggie the Magnet, a sort of platforming game, I guess, where you play as a magnet that is attracted to other magnets and you are trying to navigate levels and collect uh, gears. I've actually knocked out the first uh, entire area here, which was 10 levels, and now I'm uh, at level, I guess, 17 of everything. Uh, but right now, uh, and I'm pretty sure the entire game, the only thing you can really do is hold A and kind of just fling yourself around. Uh, so right now I have to get those two switches over there and uh, hopefully escape. So as you can see, if I hold A, I get attracted to the magnet. Right now it's stationary and in some levels it actually moves. But what we're going to do is this. Fling myself over here. Grab that one there and hopefully get myself some kind of a uh, momentum. There we go. Let myself kind of slowly roll over here. If you don't, if you're not pressing anything and you've moved, you'll continue to kind of uh, rotate the way that you uh, uh, landed. Here we go. And oh, hook ourselves up, go down, and then launch yourself. There you go, and that's a level. Uh, so yeah, this really kind of just evolves around, revolves around uh, just getting the uh, the uh, what's it called a. Uh, the gears. Uh, not that one gear, but whatever. We'll figure it out later. And uh, like I said before, nothing's really been that difficult, to be honest. Dang it. No, I want to. I want to go this way. There we go. And you'll kind of uh, follow the most like direct path to the uh, the magnet here. So we're gonna. Try Try to get up here real quick. Grab you, grab you, grab that, and then get out of here. There we go. Uh, achievements, very easy. Uh, they pretty much want you to, uh, like the hardest will probably be collecting uh, 150 of these gears. Other than that, nothing bad. And up we go. Let's see. Ooh, spikes. Oh, Ooh, you. Perfect. Uh, there are secrets. Uh, but nothing like, oops, too crazy. There we go. Let's see. I want to... Should be able to recover pretty well if I kind of just. There's one there. There it is. I was. I thought so. Bro, oh, that was. That was nice. So, I, I've played games that have physics and kind of like heavy. Oh, okay. Heavily rely on those physics. Uh, we're gonna actually backtrack and go over here. So you can actually skip levels. Uh, but back to that. I played games that rely on physics and stuff like that, where uh, if you don't get the physics just right, you are kind of out of luck and at the mercy of the game. Uh, so far, I've had no actual issues with this, even though it kind of looks chaotic. There you go. Uh, but you also, the that's funny because this is essentially a easier version of the uh, previous level. Uh, but anyways, uh, yeah, uh, it's easy enough that not having the uh, perfect physics works perfectly fine. Oopsie. All right, and up we go. Oops. Kind of move over here. Get this one. Dang it. Uh, you can skip levels if you hit the uh, bumper. Uh, the uh, bumpers, it'll let you do that, which is, it's fine. We're probably almost through this uh, level, actually. Oops, I don't know where that, I don't know where that felt like it was taking me. Dang it. I want these, I want these gears. Of war. 
I don't actually know what ha know what happens if you uh, uh, don't collect all of them and try to go back. Let's, let's figure that out. If I hit start. So, I, how many do I even have? Let's try to get this one right here. Okay, so they're kind of highlighted. That's nice. There we go. There we go. How many are there? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen, fourteen. Wow, that is that is a decent amount. But if it's only like ten levels each and they're that fast, it's not gonna be bad. All right, let's go to six where we were before. Camel. That does actually look like a camel. Sink up here. And that's going to throw us over there. Perfect. Uh, no, I want, want that though. Wonder how I'm gonna get the momentum here. Oh, I bet I need to just drop myself in the middle. It'll be fine. Mm. Yeah, that's the kind of the issue. If I don't drop myself like perfectly down, I might actually uh, keep rolling and uh, murderize myself. So I kind of just maybe. There we go. Off we go. It is nice that there are multiple, like, uh, uh, exits and stuff like that. Keep on rolling, rolling, rolling. There we go. That was easy. We got this. Oh, perfect. All right, uh, playing with fire. Oh, so can't do that. Ooh. So yeah, like this isn't, ooh, springs. Oh, okay. Get that one, get that one. That kind of does look like a faucet, I guess. But yeah, it's, it's easy enough that it's not frustrating. Like the, like the hardest part is going to be for sure, like getting the gears and that's it. And like, they're only like, they are required to like get to the next area, but the amount that are required isn't terrible actually. Like maybe, like maybe some of the like later levels are like crazy hard or something. There we go. Made it. What happens if I just kind of boing boing boing? Uh oh. Oh no, we're out of control. Oh no, we're good. Oh, I thought the magnet was higher up. But like, yes, yeah, some of the levels are more difficult or the, the they are too difficult to get the gears on. But I've gotten like you've seen I've gotten the least amount I've gotten is two. OK. And up, up. And then there, of course, there's like, oh, secret. Oh, no. Okay, so this is, it's not actually like affecting the gravity. Oh, 
Oh, this is really weird. Run that way. And... And disable. And secret world complete. That's the only issue with the secret worlds is that you gotta... Redo the normal world, I believe. I think that should count as a completion, but hey, whatever. <laughs> we be rolling, rolling, rolling. Okay, so you will slow down enough at some point. And drop. Perfect. I think you get the general idea. I am Zero JD. This is the XBLA Fans channel. Have a nice day.